it's uh, making the spicy cilantro slaw. I've got our shredded cabbage along with the Napa cabbage in a bowl. I'm mixing that together. The next time I'm going to add the, apple, or the jalapeno too, making sure that you've washed it well. You're going to cut off the stem end and then you're going to cut it in half. Cut that in half again and then cut those into quarters the best that you can. Just makes it, the chopping of it easier. This particular recipe we are leaving the seeds in to add more uh, heat to the salad itself. The seeds is where most of the heat in peppers, hot peppers, comes from. The capsaicin that's in the seeds itself. Always, always make sure that you're wearing gloves and never touch your face after you've um, chopped the jalapeno or any of the other uh, hot peppers because it will burn um, you very badly. So I'm just gonna do a fine chop. This is a really nice, refreshing alternative uh, coleslaw. It's got a nice little kick to it. It's one that we use in our fish tacos. It just complements the fish dish really nicely. It also would make a very nice uh, little um, bris or a barbecue brisket sandwich. Little um, slider buns with a Barbecue turkey, barbecue chicken. Okay, so that's that's chopped fine enough for that. Next, that's going to go in there is the cilantro, making sure that you have double washed this very well. We just want to do a fine chop on this. and that's going to go into the cabbage mixture. Okay, the next I'm going to add um, my pepper to that. It's going to be a teaspoon and a half of black pepper. And then a tablespoon of chopped garlic. add the dressing just so I can get everything mixed in together. And I'm going to add a pound of the Gerard's cilantro dressing to that. that together well. <laughs> All right, well, that's going to go onto your serving platter. That's going to go into your cooler, blast chiller to chill down to 41 degrees. And making sure that you're temping that and logging it on your PMG before it goes out into the case.